Hey guys, so in this video we will show you how to customize fonts, how to adjust the font colors and everything which is related to fonts within the split tone template from Flow Themes. So once again we'll go to the back end of our website and we'll go to Flow Theme and click on colors. So within the colors section uh, we can select and adjust all the colors related to the website. So we can have content text color and I'll set this as blue just to show you how that works. Our menu color links can be adjusted here as well. That would be red. Alright, so I've made my adjust adjustment submenu link. That would be purple and I'll click on update settings for now. I'll go here to my home page, I'll refresh it. So here I have the navigation menu. When I hover over it, it turns into orange. Once I go over to the drop down, it turns into purple and then hovers over into gray. I'll go over to my blog and my content colors uh, is blue. So this is how you adjust the colors within the website. Now we can also add custom fonts to your split tone template. And we'll go over to Google Fonts and we'll just download a random font. I'll click on Add to Collection. And we'll go ahead and download as a zip file. So we'll click on save. All right, now we'll go over to the back end and go to custom fonts. So we'll type in the title for the font and it'll be AA font. I will choose the file for my font which I just downloaded. We'll click on upload files. Here I have the font I've downloaded. And I'll just need to click on add this attachment. And then click on add new font. All right, so here I have the title, AA font. It's all set. Now if I go over to typography settings, I have my font which I've just uploaded, the AA font. So this is um, pretty much it in terms of styling, uh, styling your fonts. You have many options to choose the font height, um, choose bold or normal or thin uh, just according to the font which you are using but you can make all of those adjustments here and whenever you make that adjustment don't forget to click on update settings and you're all good to go so thanks for watching this video